Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Hope you're all doing great. Hope you're having a great start of this week. And uh, welcome to this uh, new uh, video on Bitcoin. We're going to go over everything, uh, including, obviously, excuse me, I have some, uh, I had to put my telephone away. Um, but including the technicals, obviously, yesterday we, uh, the day before we already rallied, and yesterday we rallied from 22,000 all the way up. Uh, to a top we just reached about uh, about three hours ago at around 25,000 or more specifically 24,920. Uh, so Bitcoin is very, very bullish right now. So in this video, I wanted to talk about first of all the causes of that, what's causing Bitcoin to be this bullish. Uh, but apart from that also, what can you expect now? Can we actually continue up higher where we're near our, our highs of this year, um, around 25,200? So the big question is, is can we get all the way up to 26,000? Can we maybe start thinking about 27,000 already? Um, so that's what I wanted to talk about. Now, uh, before we get into that, if you want to receive daily trading signals, check out the links in either the comments or the description. There you'll find results, but also how to join. Um, so to start off with the reason why Bitcoin is, uh, is is bullish like this, I think it's I think it's multilateral, right? So it's it's multiple parts. First of all, it's because... Um, the whole drama and the whole debacle with uh, USDC seems to have ended well. It's near its back. It hasn't actually touched its, it, its back yet, but um, we can only assume it will um, because they do have all their cash back. So if it doesn't hit the back right now, it's just a, a, a technical failure. Um, but so it, it, it was that and altogether, I also think it's a little bit, that's, that's also what we saw with the dollar strength index dropping. I think it's a little bit of optimism for the economic circumstances and there was also a, a huge binance burn which pushed through a lot of short orders um which uh, caused some sort of a short squeeze i think that's basically uh, basically what caused it um but that, that does leave it leave us with the question well are we really bullish or are we just going to drop back down to uh, 23,500 and then uh, shortly afterwards drop down below that and crash down again um and that's a good question and i think it largely depends on today Today, later today, um, probably like uh, three and a half hours from, from when I'm uploading this video, uh, we'll get the inflation rate by the US and that's going to matter a lot. All right. If it's higher than expected, that's bad. If it's lower than expected and expected is the consensus. It's good. And it's waiting for that because then we really have a clear overview of the economic circumstances. And then we can also kind of expect or at least kind of predict what we're going to get the week after uh, when we are going to have new interest rates again and also the, the federal reserve press conference around that uh, so this is really the last big economic event that has effect on that uh, so if this is lower than expected there's no reason why we could not could not go up to twenty six thousand. there really is not um, and i would go as far as saying that even um, that if it's lower than expected today, I think we'll shoot up towards 26,000. It's not that far away. As I said, we, we're, we're near our local tops. Uh, so what I expect for today is that we'll, we'll just stay in this area between 25,000 and uh, 23,500. We hit a major resistance, so perhaps we, we will drop down a little bit, but I do not expect any big moves ahead of the inflation rate. Uh, and during the inflation rate, let me know if you're interested in that. I I'm planning to do a live stream, so perhaps that's nice. Then we can uh, then we can watch it uh, together. But what I expect is basically that if it's uh, higher than expected, that will drop down at least to twenty three thousand, and probably followed by a move down to twenty two thousand again. If it's lower than expected, as I said, I expect a rally up to twenty six thousand, and from there we'll see again. I'll do uh, I'll, I'll do an update this afternoon, I think. Uh, but that's my take on uh, on Bitcoin for today. So if you do have any questions, let me know. Uh, but for now, take care, enjoy your day, and bye.